Okay, hi. This is what the blind one face near left edge up to. Still, have the fire truck parts are coming, and this is the boxes off. Did that battle by myself. And I have this truck up in the air, the wiring harness. I got the sections all ready to check out. I have that other transmission, which is different. I have the piece off it, the transfer case. And I have it all over here. So the difference is the output shaft. So this is the old transfer case. It's all broke up in pieces, but the output shaft is right here and it's still in good shape. That's the output shaft. And then, see, I got to change it to a, a flange. This is the flange. That's what I have to change it to. What's in it right now is this here. That's what's on this tran this transfer case. So I'm changing it to this type of transfer case. So this is the transfer case that's good. And I have it here all in parts. So that this is a transfer case I'm taking out. This this shaft I'm putting in the other one and changing all the parts I need to change. And hopefully it'll, that should all work out. And here's the wiring harnesses. I got, got it out of the other truck. So I'm going to be using this here to fix the other wiring harness where it's all damaged. Cut it out so I can keep all the color. Most important, I'm using this here wiring harness to keep all the colors properly. So I'll be putting a section in. I'll probably be taking this top section and bringing it down. So I only have to have... So this top section coming from the engine all the way down. I'll have all that will be the same wiring cord. Instead of me having two plugs, I'll just have to have one plug for most of it because I've, I'm using the wiring harness because it ripped the whole section out of it. So that's my way of getting around having one face near top plugs. left edge. And then over here are the fuel lines that got ripped out uh, on this table. So some of those, one of them is damaged. I got took them out of the other truck. So I have to try to take apart one edge. end of the fuel line uh, out, out, and make it go into the other one. So hopefully I'll have a video on that showing how I'm going to do it. I'm not sure if I'm going to use Near top left edge. I'm not sure what it's made of. The, Near left edge. The, the plastic. But Near I think top if edge. I use boiling water or maybe an inductor, I might be able to take the pieces apart. So, well, keep watching and see what happens. One face near top edge. And that's how I'm saving money is I'm doing all this work. It's a lot of Near labor. Top right edge. I could just go buy the parts. Near top edge. It's a fortune to buy a transmission and a transfer Centered. case and all that kind of stuff. Near top edge. So if I build it, I've done this before. So I just never done a blind. Well, I've done ATV a blind, but only one transmission automatic, just the transmission. Near top edge. Blind. Near top right edge. Doing all the wiring, and then I'll be able to put this truck back together. And I got near a top left edge. special machine coming. Near to top edge. One face near top edge. Thrust. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Near the top left edge. Man. And uh, sorry, near I top edge. haven't been too, putting up too many videos, but near top left I'm edge. my best. Have a wonderful day. Thanks.